Okay, well, I, uh, hello, Fear the Meerkat here. Welcome to another episode of Tell Me Why. Uh, yeah, um, that would probably make sense from a character point of view, but I, I think maybe Tessa has answers is a more helpful answer for us um, progressing through the game, so. What about Tessa? She was Marianne's closest friend. Let's ask her about it. Sure. And I'll warn you, she's particularly touchy about this subject. Well, maybe she'll talk to me. I was always her favorite. Operative word was. But we need to go by the store anyway. To get a few things for the repairs. Great. Two seagulls, one stale hunk of bread. I'm not sure I like that analogy. Listen, I know you don't want to keep talking about this. But you're obviously not going to be satisfied until we do. So let's talk. I mean, obviously there is something wrong. I can guess what it is, but still, I think I want to hear it from her. You've been on edge all day. Is there something more going on with you? It's nothing. Pretty sure it's not nothing. And I'd like us to be on the same page. I thought we were on the same page. Sell this place as quick as possible and move on. Look, I've already explained why this is so important to me. Why are you still dragging your feet? It's just, with the way you avoided this place for the last three years, I thought you wouldn't want to spend any extra time here. Oh. So that's what this is about. Maybe a little. Yeah. It's just... You graduated three years ago. And this is the first time we've seen each other in person. Ah, see? Thought it was a good idea to... Get this out in the open. It yeah, might as well be honest. I mean, I don't actually know which of these will be honest, because I'm not him and he's a fictional character. But, if it was me, this would probably be the reason why. It's not that I didn't want to see you. I just wasn't ready to be Tyler in Delos Crossing. I tried to visit you. I tried to go to your fireweed graduation. I wanted to bake you a crappy boxed cake and take awkwardly posed photos. I know. But you shut me out. All I got was non-responses and half-assed evasions. Well, I mean, at the moment, Tyler is kind of making this about... Yeah, I'm gonna go for this one. Look. I didn't want to see anyone. I just started testosterone. And, oh god. I had the worst acne. My emotions were all over the place and the smells. Allison, the smells... Men smell bad. I know. I've dated a few. Look, I needed some time to figure my shit out before I asked anyone else to try. Does that make sense? Yeah. Yeah, it does. So, we have a plan? Yep. We ask around about Marianne, but we also stick to our repair schedule. If that's really what you need. Alright. Deal. Ollie's Diary. It's been a long time since I heard that name. Was I the only one who ever called you that? Actually, no. I used it at Fireweed for a while, until I settled on Tyler. Most people were pretty chill about the switch. Not everyone, though. What do you mean? I had a mentee who refused to call me Tyler. He didn't want my help. He didn't want anyone's help. I'm sorry. I like the name Tyler, by the way. Thanks. Well, I'm not gonna wait. Yeah. Oh, I...
Okay, I'm not really interested in... You can buy the game and read it for yourself. If you squint, you can almost forget Talos Crossing's only a few miles away. I'm sure Marianne tried to. Can't blame her. We're headed there for supplies later. Are you ready for that? Yeah, but I was really enjoying a day without assholes. Just a little longer, and every day will be asshole-free. That might be asking a lot. Nice ring. Get from your boyfriend? Come on. I told you I'm not with anyone right now. Don't rub it in. Why does it look familiar? It was a gift from Eddie. He had them both made at the same time. Both? Oh, wait. Yeah. This ring is supposed to be linked to the one he gave you, in a spiritual way. Do you believe in all that? You mean, do I believe we could be linked in some other metaphysical way? You know, other than the one that already lets us share thoughts and memories. Fair enough. Uh, all right. I think that's enough time enjoying the view. I wasn't going to say anything, but... Yeah, yeah, I know. I was the one all eager to go, and then I started waxing poetic about the landscape. Go ahead. I'll catch up. Need to respond to a message. Ah, uh -huh. my sister. The social butterfly. Seems we got a trespasser. Huh? What the fuck? You got five seconds to talk me into defending my property. That's really not long. That's just enough to say, hello, I... Your property? Five. Four. I'm Tyler. Don't know any Tylers. Three. Two. Sam! Ellie? What are you doing out here, girl? This is our house. Was I talking to you? Sam, put the gun down. This is Tyler. My brother. Well, your brother? Oh, shit. Huh. I guess I heard about all that, but I never... <laughs> Damn, <laughs> you look like a Kids. real man. So do you, Sam. You know what I mean. I just didn't know they could make a woman look so much like a man. Y yes. There's going to be a lot of these in this game, isn't there? Sorry, Tyler. You know, I'm just trying to be me. It's just who I am. Hmm. Well, I've seen a couple of lady transvestites on the TV before, but, uh, I've never seen a dude. Sam, that's not how you say that. Say what? Transvestites? Yes. It's transgender. Transgender men. Uh, I'm sorry. It's hard to keep track out here in Delos Crossing. <laughs> the world's just moving on without us. It's fine. Let's just change the subject. <laughs> Works for me. Tyler. Thanks, Sam. So, what are you doing here exactly? Oh, well, I, uh... I've been kind of keeping an eye on this place for you, you know? It's like patching the roof, checking the pipes, and all that stuff. Thank you, Sam. Oh, yeah, yeah, it's, uh, that's no big deal. I just, you know, your mama, she was, uh, she was a special lady. She deserved much better than, you know, uh, what you got. Didn't you used to help Mary Ann with repairs and building projects? Oh, yeah. Yeah, seeing as your mama never had a man around, I just I took it on myself to help her keep this place standing. How antiquated of you. Thanks. I uh, guess you two are still aiming to sell the place? 
You know, actually, I think it was quite nice of Sam to do that. I mean, if if Mum didn't want to do the DIY, I don't want to do DIY particularly. You know, I, I don't think there's... I suppose Taylor has a reason to still be angry with Sam, but still... Sam was probably just doing something nice. That's the plan. Which, by the way, we need your keys. Since apparently you went and changed the locks? Oh yeah, absolutely. But, uh, selling your mother's house? Are you sure? Bad or good? It's all you've got left of her. Hmm. I don't intend to be a jerk, so... Not all. I'm sure the gun she tried to kill us with is still somewhere in there. Tyler! What? What Tyler means is, a fresh start is what we both need. Of course. Uh, this place has got to be full of all kinds of bad memories. But maybe some good ones, too? should get going. That's all you think we'll get out of him? Hmm. I guess I could ask him a few more questions. Okay. How well did you know her? Not as well as I thought. When I heard what happened that night, well... I figured people were bullshitting me. It really surprised you, didn't it? Much as anything ever has. Other folks say they saw it coming. Not me. Did you help with her door? Her door? The puzzle on her bedroom door. Oh. Oh, yeah. yeah. You two kept sneaking in, giving her no privacy, huh? You ever solve it? Yep. Better late than never, I guess. Uh, never solved it myself. I mean, not that I wanted to. I, I, uh, uh so, uh, guess you know all your mama's secrets now, huh? Well. She may have one or two left. Um. Yeah, I'm not sure that there's, there's really anything else we can ask the guy. Um. We should get going. That's all you think we'll get out of it? Um, I think that it's not giving me the option to ask any more questions. But look, I'll give this one more go and and see what I can get. If I can't get anything else, then we'll go and um, I, I'm just going to skip over this bit until I get something new. We should get going. That's all you think we'll get out of him? He's too wasted to be of any more help. Aha, there we go. Tell him to get a move on then. Well, we've got a supply run to make and Uncle Eddie's expecting a visit, so. Oh, right. Yeah, of course. Uh, get going, you two. Um, Sam, we all gotta get going. 
Oh, uh, of course. Of course, yeah, I got lots to do myself. I, lots of to-dos on old Sam's list. Uh, and you don't want to keep Brown waiting, you know? <laughs> Thanks for looking out for this place. Happy to do it. I... Uh, don't hesitate to reach out if you need anything. Anything at all. You hear? Sam? Huh? Uh, Sam? Huh? The keys? Oh, yeah. Of course. Of course. Yeah, they're, they're yours. I, uh... uh mm. This place, it meant a lot to your mother. It almost felt like it was a part of her, and, and it's like some part of her is alive here still. Hopefully the house doesn't turn out to be a murderous psycho that tries to kill us in our sleep, huh? Uh, yeah. Well, uh, take care of yourself, uh, both of you. Hey, so, we really do have a lot to do. Okay, go on. I'll be right behind you. might not get the chance to look at other stuff in the house, but I don't think you've missed anything that's vitally important, at a guess. Ready to Veni Vidi Vecchi? I'm ready to talk to Tessa. I don't speak Latin. Just try to keep in mind that your memory of her is ten years out of date. Yeah, well, it wouldn't be if she reached out to me while I was in Fireweed, which she didn't. So I'm guessing this is Michael? Let's go and say hi. Hey, you. Hey, isn't it your day off? Yep, we're here as patrons. Tyler, meet Michael. This is the annoying coworker I was telling you about. <sighs> I was there for your introduction of marshmallow vodka and wine coolers, and I've only worked my way up to annoying coworker. Rude. <laughs> Don't worry, she told me exactly how miserable she'd be in this town without you. It's so good to finally meet you. The Tyler talk goes on 24 seven, so I feel like I already know you. So, uh, you here to grab some stuff for the homestead, or...? Yeah, we decided it'd be easiest if we just stayed out there. We'll get it cleaned up faster if we literally cannot escape it. Hey, I'm all for efficiency. Cannot wait for us to get out of here. <sighs> What's that? Yeah, I'm gonna go for it. Um, Michael is moving to Juno, too. We were thinking of being roommates. Oh. Okay. Thinking about it? You better not be backing out on me. The only thing that gets me up some mornings is marking one more day off the calendar. <laughs> Don't worry, she won't. We'll get the house sold and you guys can move on. There could be room for you too. <laughs> for sure. The more Ronins, the merrier. I'm studying to be a chef, so uh, you know it'll be good eating. And hey, I only snore during allergy season. And baseball. <laughs> How can I say no to that? <laughs> <sighs> 
You okay? Dead on my feet, girl. Got up at four to fish before work. It's been a day. Oh, you like to fish? Yeah, there's this spot called Buzzard Hole I go to at least twice a week. It's like an hour drive, but it's so chill, especially first thing in the morning. Shut up. I used to go there all the time. For real? Yeah. Hey, well, if you want to go sometime, holler at me. I don't mind sharing. Cool. Most guys I know get all smeagol about their fishing spots. <laughs> <laughs> oh, look at you two. Bonding over the most slow and boring way to kill an animal. She's just jealous because she couldn't catch a fish. Even if she filled the lake with cyanide I'm first. So, oh, killing fish is fine. Tyler, we better get started with our Killing bears isn't... Oh, okay, I admit. Bears... Some species of bears might be an endangered species. Yeah. I'll be around if you need anything. Sorry to make you one here. Oh, um, oh, wait a sec. No, I'm not sure why we have that. That glow thing there, and then we can't, can't actually talk. In our minds for each other. Well, hello, Miss Ronan. Did you forget something in the office? No, just doing some shopping. You remember my brother, Tyler? Your brother? Oh, right, Tyler. What a pleasant surprise. Didn't Allison tell you I'd be by today? Yes, I think she did. I just didn't expect to see such a dapper young man. Well, I did shower this morning. <laughs> did you just get back into town, or...? More or less. We've been working out at the old house, but surprise, surprise, after ten years of sitting empty, it was missing a few things, hence the supply run. Ah, right. Well, we'll get you set right up. It must be nice to be home. Uh, I'm not sure nice is the word for it. Oh, of course. I assume being there feels complicated. That's one way to describe it. Well, don't let me keep you any longer. I'll be here if you need anything. Oh, hey, is Tessa around today? Um, the wife's not in at the moment. I'm sure she'll be around later, though. Okay, so we need candles and an all-purpose cleaner. Well, um... Starving. Uh, the, the last episode was quite long. Um, I, I think that's probably a good time to end this episode. I will see you next time.